Five secrets to get eight bands in IELTS speaking. I know many students find difficulty in speaking module, though they are very good at writing. I am Dr. Arsh Noor, an IELTS instructor. I am going to help you by giving five tips, which will definitely help you to elevate your band score up to minimum seven plus score. So we are going to discuss first part one. Now the tip number one is you have to be very natural. Don't have fake accent and give relevant answer to the examiner because sometimes students start giving irrelevant answers which is leading towards negative scores. And it is very very important to understand the question as you answer because sometimes students do not understand the question properly and are unable to respond in a good manner they either give irrelevant answer or go with some unwanted information now this is very important that the student should give relevant answer to the examiner by understanding the question properly Tip number two, if the examiner asks you, tell me about your favorite color, don't end up by saying my favorite color is white, yellow, blue, green or anyone. Here the tip is add why. You have to explain why do you like this color, otherwise it will be only for two to three seconds answer whereas in part one every question requires minimum 20 seconds of the answer so it may range from 15 to 25 seconds but must elaborate your answer up to two to three lines here you may say that my favorite color is blue i like this color because you may give some details regarding this as if I go with my myself my favorite color is blue and I'll answer I feel cool relaxed and confident while wearing this color or in the ambience of this color means under the open sky or in the room walled by blue color it is a color of freedom and nature because most of the nature is found in this color as sea and sky are also of blue color so i feel energetic rejoiced when i go in the atmosphere of green color especially when so i'm stressed i'm depressed i prefer to go in the atmosphere of blue color now tip number three be to the point don't give unnecessarily exaggerated answer for example if the examiner asks you do you like to have more number of friends or less number of friends directly start your answer like i like to have less number of friends or more number of friends so you may say that i like to have less number of good friends instead of gathering more friends then why personal we cannot share our problem with everyone we cannot be personal with everyone so in this way you can answer the questions to the point some students start saying friends are very important in one's life and uh, i have many friends but some are good friends of mine whereas some are not so close to me so this really takes you away from the question so be to the point and answer the question accordingly it is not your cue card it is only the topic to be spoken for two to three lines maximum or up to 15 to 25 seconds maximum now come with a tip number four students is very very important for you to have proper information about the general question usually asked to you in the first part 
for that reason you should research find and prepare your first part properly it is your in your hands because first part question are the same as these were 20 years ago you can easily find these questions on google or you can find this on net and can prepare and can prepare these properly as we know that the first impression is the last impression if you keep hold on the first part definitely you will be liable to get good scores afterwards so that's the reason don't miss this part and prepare this part thoroughly you can go and check the list of the general questions asked these are called introductory questions also on the net these are widely available anywhere prepare this in this case you will get confident and sometimes you may get the answer for your q card also because there are lot of material available on the net and you can even get the ideas to prepare your q card afterwards now come with the tip number 5 avoid repetition students is very very important for you sometimes what happens is students start repeating the same sentences same words again again and this will definitely go on the negative side and you will lose your score due to deficiency of the vocabulary i don't ask you to go with the too much number of the vocab words but at least you should cram some of the phrases you should go with some of the important words like if i go with important word important has many synonyms and important word is really very crucial word you can use many words instead of important it's crucial pivotal vital significant in similar way you can find many vocab words in the form of the synonyms for the most used word in our daily conversational life student hope these five tips or the five secrets will help you to improve your band score in ielts